run. Just run. Well, it's raining outside and today I've got some packing to do, uh, so first I've got to find the items, so I'll get on and do that I suppose. What even is that song? I haven't even a clue. Oh, bubble butt. Bubble 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 butt, bubble bubble butt. Better not sing anymore, or else I'll get copyright crap. This is why you don't put papers all in the same thing, because you have to get right to the bottom to find the one you're bloody looking for, don't you? And I reckon this one's like, oh, here it is. See, kids, don't take any advice from me. Do, 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 do. Oh no, it's not there. Oh no, it's not even that one. It's going to be further down. No, why is it further down? Oh my god, no. Oh, why? Oh my god, I hate myself. Oh god, oh god. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. Sold, yeah. Coronation one, I think. 1953. Well, I move this out of the way, and then you can see it better. Yeah. Uh, well, you might be able to see it better. The light's a bit funny, but yeah. Coronation one. Boom. I think it sold for about a tenner. Not huge money, but you know, it's not really brilliant newspaper, is it? Uh, so yeah. Put all these back now. Slowly, conscientiously, because you know we enjoy what we do. We don't need to rush. So, you know, slowly putting things back. God, too many people rush, 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 you know? And they, they don't get things done in the way they should get them done, you know? Anyway, don't take advice from me. This isn't, if this isn't financial advice or any sort of advice, it's just me rambling at the camera. Um, so yeah, you know, ooh, that's cool, isn't it? I, I liked this one when I, when I was listing it, I liked that one, Tutankhamun. Cool, it's a cool cover. Day of Day of Liberation. Daily Mail, Day of Li Liberation. Boom. I think I've only got about five to pack. Uh, but it's sold. I'm doing daily packing at the moment. Sometimes I don't do daily packing, but then sometimes I do. Um, so I think I got about five sales yesterday. So not amazing, but not terrible at the same time. Um, don't know what I did... Oh, I must have done an over 100 quid yesterday because I got a 30 quid sale at the end of the day and uh, I think that must have took me over 100 so I was pretty happy with that and then we've got all these here these are the little ones actually I'm going to put those I'm going to put these ones in first because these are the larger ones yeah and then the little ones on top there we go the little ones can go on top right there we go that can go back up shouldn't have to do it but well I don't really have to do it to be honest because I don't get much hair for some weird reason probably be about 28 before I get a beard like a full-on beard <laughs> some hair and you can just about hear it cutting it off I think 
Oh god, I'm gonna get gonna cut myself. <gasps> oh well. I cut myself, I cut myself. Oh yeah. Getting proper loads of hair off there. So I have had a little bit of a sort out, not a major one, but just a little bit of a sort out. And I pulled some items out to photograph, which are down there. And I've also got some stuff on there. Basically, all this pile here is to photograph. There is a few things in that pile, though, that need uh, sorting out. I've got a nice vinyl record in there that needs testing before it can go on. Uh, and there's a studio pottery uh, pot. It's that sort of uh, clay one at the bottom there. What do you call it? Not clay. What's it called? Uh, oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. It begins with a T. The word begins with a T. Oh, oh, no, it's gone anyway. But I mean that one there. I'm trying to reference the colour of it. What do you call it? T. It begins with a T. I don't know. Someone in the comments, drop it down in the comments below. Um, but yeah, so, got a few bits sorted. I did do a bit of sorting under here. This is kind of like my pile of shame. So there's a lot of stuff in here that I'm just like, oh, do I have to deal with it? Um, but, you know, the things that I pulled out for today, I'm fairly happy with. Got a load of comics on here. Wait, well, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cut the video here, and then I'll, sh I'll show you in a little bit more depth. Terracotta, that's the word I was looking for. Uh, and yeah, it's a really cool looking little pot here. Um, and it's got this mark on the back. I've actually had this in the pile of shame for like m literally two months. And I showed it on a haul video ages and ages and ages ago. No, actually, I say two months. It's probably more like about... I think I don't have any perception of time. It's probably about four or five months. Like, I don't even know. Um, but it's got that mark on the bottom and I've not done any research on it. And I'm just like putting it off listing, putting it off listing. But I think it might be of half decent value. So... Yeah, it's got this like little uh, face on it here. Um, so yeah, that's that one. And then I'll pull out the record as well. So it's this record here. It's a 90s uh, band, I think, this cast all change. Um, I never, I've never heard of this band. Um, this is the record with the, the misprint. Um, so it's actually worth quite a lot of money. It's worth about 120 or something. I think, did I pay 30 or 40? I, pay, I did pay about 30 or 40 in a charity shop, so I did pay a fair bit for it. But I thought to myself, you know what, I'll go for it at that and... Uh, whoa, things are falling. Um, this, is a, this is a very frequent sight for me, things falling around and stuff. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go for about 120 on that and uh, I need to test it before I uh, list it. But yeah, pretty cool that one. And it is a double pack, I think, does it say there? Double... Double vinyl, yeah. And it's got the booklet. It's got everything in there with it, so pretty happy with it. Uh, I did look it over in the charity shop. It wasn't tested. It hadn't. It's not been sold or tested or anything. But the records, the, the vinyl was in brilliant condition, like absolutely brilliant. So uh, no doubt that it will work. So yeah, pretty happy with that one. And then I've got a load of uh, Superboy comics up there as well. But I'm just going to do as one big bundle. I'm going to take them out of these plastic sleeves to photograph them and do them as one big bundle at some point. Uh, I might do them on auction or I might set... No, you know what? I'll probably do them on Buy It Now, actually, because I reckon, I reckon Buy It Now would be better for them, to be honest. And I could do... I don't know. I could, could probably get a fair bit of money for them because there's quite a lot there. I mean, individually, we don't go for a lot of money. But as a nice big bundle, it'd probably get some fair, fair bit of money for them. So, yeah, that's those anyway. So, doing well so far. I've done my packaging, I've done my sorting, I've done my photography. I got a little bit of reading in this morning as well. As some of you may well, uh, may well be aware, I'm trying to read a little bit more. I've got a huge amount of books in my Amazon basket to buy. I've probably got... 350, 400 pounds worth of books, which is insane, and there's no way I'm spending all that in one go, so I'm going to have to sort of just buy them in uh, little lots, I suppose. I've got about 10 books uh, down, sort of on my bedside, um, ready to read that I've not read, so yeah, I've got plenty of books to read. I'm really excited for reading them. Um, I'm just finishing my second book, actually. And yeah, it's just it's just a really nice pursuit just reading and I never really was a fan of it. I really didn't like it, but now I'm starting to get into it because I'm reading the books that I want to read. I always thought that, well, I didn't always think this, but I always went down the route of pursuing books that 
I was just reading for the sake of reading and it's just a pointless pursuit really that. So I'm concentrating on actually reading stuff I want to read and that I'm very, very interested in. Um, and, and it's just a breeze really. It's just so easy and it's so nice to absorb that knowledge uh, from the books that I'm obviously interested in. So that being said, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do a sales update. I didn't plan, well, I semi plan to do one but I thought to myself I might do one I might not it depends whether I can fit it in I also had my grandma coming around in a little bit because it's Friday and she always comes around to see me on a Friday so I've got that to obviously fit in as well um, but I've got a bit of time spare so I'm gonna do a quick sales update now so on the front of it my videos look quite decent but then you know actually behind the scenes there's just mess everywhere and uh, it's not so good really but yeah also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Get me to 50k. I want to be earning that bear YouTube money. You know, bear. 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 You know, bear YouTube money. Bear. 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 So, I don't know where I last left you. I think it was when I was doing the sales update, but I can't be 100% sure. Um, after that, I uh, I did some walking, I did some steps. Uh, my grandma came round, I went to the co-op, I had some lunch. We're now at 1 o'clock. I don't know, what, did I just say that? I can't even remember whether I just said that. My memory is terrible, but um, yeah, it's 1 o'clock now. I need to get on and do some listing. After that, I want to do some editing, I want to see my friend, I want to do some reading, I think I've got some labelling up to do, I need to share with you my totals for the week that I've got written on the board up there, I just stole the idea from Lonnie, which is Garage Flip, so feel free to check out his channel, because I basically just stole his momentum board idea thing, but to be honest, it's a good idea, you know, it's a good idea, so I'm, I'm going to utilise any good ideas, so with that being said, I'll get on with some listing now, and I'll catch up with you in a little bit. So there is it fully wrote down there. Um, now last weekend I didn't do any listing. This weekend I might do a few listings just to keep that ball rolling because I, as, as I said, this week hasn't been the best. It didn't get off to a great start listing wise. So I feel like I ought to do a little bit more work over the weekend. Um, but we'll see. I might. What I might do is have Saturday no, not doing any listing and then Sunday doing a bit of listing or vice versa, whatever. Um, but yeah, 48 listings and approximately £810. I was just adding these up in my uh, head, so it might be very, very slightly off, but it's going to be around that 810 811 something like that. Um, so yeah, a little bit less than I would have liked to see, but it's okay. There's always next week, and uh, I've got plenty of stock down at my lockup to be uh, ploughing through, so definitely uh, next week I'm going to get on it a little bit more and see what I can do. So I've got to label that stuff up later on and as I mentioned in a previous segment I want to do some editing as well either this afternoon or later on tonight. Uh, but for now I'm going to go around my friend's house. Uh, I've not seen him too much today, uh, not today, too much this week even. Uh, so I would like to see him a little bit, bit today. Um, other than that I don't think I've got much else to do really reselling wise. I don't know why but my gimbals going a bit crazy and going back in two um but yeah anyway i will see you in the next segment just doing a little bit of editing for my philosophy channel this is a very very long video i've done 55 minutes it is now uh, 5 35 uh, i got back from my friends a while ago actually and i've kind of just been procrastinating a little bit i went on a walk um I did actually put a few things away that needed going away in storage, but that was about it. Um, I need to do my labelling in, in a little bit, um, but that'll be about it for the day. So guys, I have just had my tea, and uh, obviously I got that editing done. It's quite a long video to edit. I didn't really do any editing of it though, to be honest, because it flowed really, really nicely, and I just wanted to let the words speak for themselves, really. I don't like doing too much editing over on my philosophy channel, because I just can... I tend to just get into a flow and it's just nice and I don't want to distract people by doing loads of different edits on it. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do some labelling but first I'm going to go out for a walk. But I'd say I will leave it there today and uh, thank you very much for joining me. If you haven't already, please do like and subscribe and uh, yeah, I will see you in the next one.
I'll give you what I got The alcohol of that is flowing wild So grab yourself a can of mine